Greetings, everybody. The goal of this part of your training is to get used to the feel of using an active board. So think about it as a really big computer. And when you bring your pen up to the board, you are having the opportunity at that surface to manipulate your computer. A couple things that could help you out. First of all, let me tell you a couple things about the pen. Um, if you look on the right side of this presentation, um, you will see the first style of pen that we used in the district when we first started buying boards, the one with the gray and the orange. On the left hand side are the newer pens that come with the newest board. Um, the reason why there are two different pens is the dark gray one is called the teacher pen and the light gray one is called the student pen because with our newer active boards, which um, are, have a thicker, darker gray border than the old boards, uh, we have the ability to support what we call dual users, which means that two people could be at the board at one time. And if two people were at the board at one time, you'd want to be using two different colors of pens. So one of the things to note is that with an, if you have one of these pens at the board and you hover over the board, that means that you don't touch it. If you hover over the board, you should see that the cursor is going to follow where you move the pen. So it's much like the trackpad on your laptop or a mouse on a computer. It is how you control the cursor. If you touch the board with the pen, that's like clicking on your trackpad or on your mouse. If you double click, it works the same way that a trackpad or a mouse would. Oftentimes that's going to open a folder or launch a piece of software. So um, what you're going to want to do, you could pause this video if you wanted to and you could connect to the board and you could try these pens. Note that there is um, what I sometimes call the barrel button. On the dark gray button um, pen, it's right here. On the right gray button, it's right here. Or right, right, excuse me. On the orange and gray pen, it's right here. And the barrel button is used to make what we would traditionally call a control click or a right click on a computer. So um, those are the pens. One other thing to note. If you connect to the board and you put your pen to the board and the cursor does not line up exactly where the pen is, you need to do what we call calibration. So look at the board and in the upper left hand corner there is a flame or a light with a flame in it. If you hover over that, that means that you hold your hand still over that flame, um, you are going to start the process that we call calibration. And then this is to line up the pen with the cursor on the board. Now if you have trouble getting calibration to start by hovering over the flame, you just hold it there for about five seconds. Then you can do calibration this way by going up to your active manager. You click on the active manager and you choose calibrate. So watch what happens when I calibrate the board. When I do that, the entire board should go white and then you, you have the instructions to click anywhere on the surface to begin. So if I click, then I'm going to get a crosshair in the upper left hand corner, move your pen that you're holding because you're standing at the board and click on the cross. Then you do that in all four corners, two, three, four, and then the last one is in the middle on the left. Click on that and then um, you are, come back to your desktop view and you should be lined up so that when you bring the cursor, excuse me, the pen up to the board, it'll be lined up on the cursor. Um, that's how you calibrate.